When it comes to the field of construction or the world of mining, there are certain machines you need to get the job done more often than not. One of the biggest of them is dump trucks. These beasts are built for one very specific mission, hauling massive loads of dirt and dumping them wherever the job demands. It might sound basic, but when you're tearing through layers of earth or prepping a site for something huge, these trucks are absolutely crucial. So with that in mind, here are the 15 biggest dump trucks in the world that push the limits of size, strength and raw power. Number 15. Komatsu 980E. One thing you can't overlook when it comes to these trucks is the raw size. The Komatsu 980E4 makes that obvious. Take a look at the tires or the sheer size of the bucket, it'll make just about anyone feel tiny. But that's what's needed on serious sites worldwide. This machine is made to haul heavy loads, and it's backed by an engine and powertrain that can take on the pressure. Another standout feature is that it runs on electric drive, meaning lower emissions compared to many others in its category. That also makes it more environmentally friendly, and considering what we talked about earlier, that's a good thing. It's also built for fast maintenance. Things go wrong on job sites, that's just a fact, and this truck's design makes it easier to figure out what failed and fix it without wasting time. A vehicle that large going down can cause major setbacks, so being able to get it back in action fast is a huge advantage. Number 14. D8774 Mining Truck Back in May 2018, a Slovenian company called ETF Mining Equipment shook up the heavy machinery world with the D8774 Mining Truck. At the time, it wasn't just another oversized machine, it officially became the world's largest mining dump truck by payload capacity. With the ability to carry up to 774 tons, it crushed the record set by the previous leader, the BAZ model. And they didn't just inch past the competition, they leaped forward by over 300 tons. What makes it even more impressive, is that it's not running on traditional diesel like most others. This monster is all electric. No emissions, less noise, and surprisingly smooth operation for a vehicle of its size. It's not often you see something that massive running silently. If more companies followed this blueprint, job sites around the world would look very different. It hasn't become the global standard yet, but what ETF pulled off with the D8774 is enough to make the entire industry take notice. Number 13, R100E. The R100E might not be the biggest truck in the game, but it knows how to do its job without draining your entire fuel budget. This model carries 95 tons and was built with one main focus, efficiency through smart engineering. Its engine and transmission are electronically linked, delivering better gear shifts and smoother overall performance. That consistent momentum helps cut fuel usage during long runs, and that's where real savings stack up. The structure is just as solid, built with high-impact, abrasion-resistant steel that can handle long-term abuse without constant repairs. This truck also includes safety-first features that start from the inside out, making it dependable in both performance and protection. The cabin gives the driver full control without distractions, and every system works to reduce unnecessary strain on the machine. It's not trying to outmuscle the competition, it's made to last longer, cost less, and stay reliable on real job sites. For those focused on durability and long-term use, the R100E brings exactly what's needed, nothing extra, nothing missing. A good pocket-friendly monster. Number 12. Komatsu 930E. When it comes to electric drive dump trucks, the Kumatsu 930E4 is setting the pace for the industry. First revealed in 2016, this powerhouse isn't just a symbol of innovation, it's Kumatsu's largest electric rear dump truck. With a monstrous payload capacity of 292 tons and massive bucket shovels that scoop up to 76 cubic meters at a time, it's built for serious, large-scale mining. What makes it stand out isn't just size, it's the switch in energy. 
As industries begin drifting away from diesel-only fleets, this truck is a step toward cleaner, more sustainable solutions. Even though it's not Kumatsu's biggest rig, it's their flagship for a reason, it's reliable, efficient, and ready for the future. Imagine entire fleets powered electrically, cutting down the pollution caused by 24-hour mining shifts. While that future isn't fully here yet, the 930E4 proves it's within reach. With durability, power, and smart energy use rolled into one, this beast is showing that doing the heavy lifting doesn't have to come at Earth's expense. Number Undisi, Caterpillar 790. When you're a brand as well established as Caterpillar, you've earned the right to brag a little. The 797F proves that point. It's one of the most reliable and productive trucks they've ever put on the market. On their official site, Caterpillar calls it the most productive truck out there, and after looking at the specs, it's hard to argue. While many trucks focus only on power or payload, the 797F also comes with one of the most advanced braking systems in its class. That matters. It also features a seriously tough body and frame that'll take a beating without breaking down. That's the kind of design crews count on in real-world conditions. The 797F is fast, fuel-efficient, and built for long-term productivity. Caterpillar markets it as the benchmark for lower cost per ton in its class, and they've got the data to back that up. People stick with CAT for a reason, because when they say their machines work hard, they've already proved it on job sites all over the world. Number DC. Caterpillar 795 FAC. Caterpillar is a name that practically defines heavy duty. And the 795 FAC, it's one of their crown jewels. This dump truck sits in the elite top 10 based on raw payload capacity, flaunting a massive Cat C 175 16 diesel engine that cranks out more than 3,400 horsepower. That's enough to haul mountains of dirt without even breaking a sweat. It uses Caterpillar's proprietary AC electric drive system, pushing this beast up to 64 km per H. While job sites rarely need that kind of speed, it's a feature that shows how far these machines have come. The cab is fitted with diagnostics and monitoring systems, giving the driver total control and awareness of the truck's status in real time. From its powerful frame to its efficient performance, everything about this model screams reliability. It's built for those who want minimal downtime, maximum hauling, and a truck that can handle daily punishment without faltering. Caterpillar didn't hold back here. They built something that delivers both muscle and brains. What do you think about it? Let us know. Number 9. Terex MT 6300 AC. It didn't start as a Caterpillar. Originally introduced by Terex in 2008, this 400-ton payload giant has bounced through a few hands. It was renamed Bosiris in 2010 before finally becoming part of Caterpillar's unit rig line. Even with that complicated history, the truck's legacy is strong. This thing was built to move serious mass, and with its 20-cylinder four-stroke diesel engine pushing out 3,750 horsepower, it delivers every bit of it. It still ranks among the world's biggest dump trucks, not just by size, but by the workload it handles daily across mining operations. Whether it's transporting crushed ore or oversized rock from deep pits, the MT6300 AC doesn't blink, no extra flare, just a machine built to go hard. That said, its story does remind you that not every standout vehicle comes from one brand. Sometimes it's about how the core design holds up no matter who's managing the nameplate. This one's proof that good engineering outlasts logos. Number Auto. Hitachi EH5000 AC3. The Hitachi EH5000 AC3 might have a mouthful of a name, but behind the technical lingo is one of the most capable rigid frame dump trucks on the market. It's the largest model Hitachi has ever built, and they made sure every inch of it counts. At the core is an advanced AC drive system that ensures top-tier performance and reliable power delivery across tough terrain. Whether it's in a copper mine or at a massive construction site, this beast is designed to deliver no excuses. 
What sets it apart is the combination of brute strength with surprisingly user-friendly controls. The operator's cab is crafted for comfort, the interface is intuitive, and its responsive handling means less fatigue for the driver. On top of that, it's built like a tank, durable enough to handle daily abuse while keeping performance consistent. Hitachi didn't just build a massive machine here, they engineered a long-term workhorse that does exactly what you need without cutting corners or stalling out in rough conditions. Number 7. BA 7560. The Bayez 7560 is a lineup of ultra-class haul trucks built in Belarus by OJSC Belarusian Auto Works. Sounds formal, sure, but it's important. This particular truck was made not just to handle mining and construction work, but also the rugged roads leading to those sites. That might sound odd, but it matters. It was also designed to manage loosened rocks, a major factor in mining zones. Rocks are a huge deal. If you're mining for something like gold and don't properly deal with it, they can mess up your wash plants and wreck your whole setup. And don't underestimate them. In some regions, these rocks can be over a meter long and weigh a ridiculous amount. The Bayez 7560 is built to drag those around without issue. The manufacturer claims it can handle those loads in all kinds of weather and road conditions, and that's exactly why this model is actively used around the globe, because it's built to last and deliver. Number 6. BA75710. So far we've looked at plenty of trucks with big-time capacity, but this one, this was the best in the world for a while. The BA75710 had a payload limit of 450 tons and held the number one spot for the largest mining truck on earth for nearly five years. Think about that. Five years at the top. Most companies would be lucky to hold that title for a year, but BAAs kept it going for half a decade. What makes this model stand out even more is its engine setup. Unlike most trucks that rely on a single diesel engine, this one has two. You can run both when hauling max loads or switch to one when the weight's lighter, giving you flexibility depending on the job. It's no longer the biggest truck around, but it still holds its own. Whether you're running full capacity or dialing it back for a smaller haul, the BA75710 was built to get the work done and do it fast. Number 5. Liebherr T284 well, there are plenty of ways to make a powerful dump truck. One that's efficient, tough, and dependable. With the Liber T284, it's all that, but also lighter. This model is a step up from the one before it, boasting the lowest empty weight in its class while offering the highest payload in ultra-class mining. That's a serious flex. It delivers over 4,000 horsepower and is built to reduce fuel consumption while maintaining strength. That combo sounds strange, lightweight but powerful, but Liebherr pulled it off. Less overall weight means the engine doesn't burn through fuel just to get moving, and that's a win for job sites trying to cut running costs. With trucks like this, companies don't need to flood the site with more machines. Fewer trucks still get the same work done, or throw in a few more and finish up faster. Either approach works, and this truck makes both options possible with solid performance across the board. Number 4. Terex MT 5500 AC Also known as the Unit Rig MT 5500 AC, this truck made a name for itself by handling high-volume surface mining without missing a beat. It has a payload capacity of 360 tons, and that power makes it especially useful for jobs that require serious overburden removal. Overburden, the unusable dirt and layers built up over time, has to be cleared before miners can access valuable resources below, and this truck is made for that exact kind of digging. Terex built this model to take on heavy runs again and again, and it holds up under constant stress. The build itself is straightforward and industrial, it's not about looking sleek, it's about function, power and non-stop movement across giant sites. With each cycle it hauls enough to keep operations moving without wasting time or fuel. For mining companies focused on reliable throughput and high efficiency, the MT5500 AC checks every box. 
It's a workhorse with a reputation for consistency, and that's exactly what matters in this kind of work. Number 3. SRT-95C Well, compared to the giants on this list, the SRT-95C might seem small, but that's the point. This truck was built for jobs that don't demand massive payloads. 95 tons is more than enough when you're working on tighter sites or specific projects that don't need bulk hauling. What makes the SRT-95C stand out isn't size, but efficiency. It's got wide panoramic views from the cabin for better visibility, along with a design that helps the operator stay focused and in control. Not every job calls for a mega truck that eats fuel and takes an hour to load. Sometimes the right move is a machine that's easier to handle, doesn't take up half the site, and still gets the work done without issue. The SRT-95C covers that ground really well. It's built for reliability over excess, and that makes it a solid choice for smaller operations or budget-conscious contractors who still want something durable, simple, and built with performance in mind. Number 2. Terex Titan 3319. In 1973, Terex introduced something that didn't just turn heads, it set a benchmark for haul trucks. The Titan 3319 was a prototype, but it wasn't shelved like most concept builds. When completed, it held the record as the highest capacity haul truck in the world. And even though only one unit was built, it worked for over a decade in real mining conditions. This wasn't a test machine. It was part of the fleet. After retirement, it didn't vanish into a scrapyard. It was fully restored, and now stands on display in Canada, close to where it was originally built. That's a rare outcome for a one-off model. The Titan's design helped influence what came next in mining vehicle engineering, and for over 20 years it kept its title. Not every truck earns a place in history, but the Titan 3319 did. It's not just a piece of equipment, it's part of a legacy that helped shape how heavy mining operations are handled across the globe today. Number 1. Komatsu 960E Komatsu doesn't miss when it comes to mining giants and the 960E2 is a prime example. Built for ultra-heavy lifting, it's a favorite across job sites that demand non-stop performance. With a design focused on load stability and fuel efficiency, this truck balances brute force with smart engineering. One of its strongest points is how it distributes power evenly across the chassis, an edge when dealing with uneven terrain. That means fewer breakdowns and smoother operation, even in brutal work environments. It's also got systems in place to manage environmental hazards. If the ground turns slick with rain or mud, Onboard tech detects the shift and adjusts for grip, reducing the risk of slippage or accidents. And let's not forget fuel economy. These trucks run for hours, so squeezing out more from every drop is a massive win. Komatsu made the 960E2, not just to move dirt, but to do it safely, efficiently, and with minimum downtime. This isn't just a machine, it's a solution. We hope you've enjoyed this video, if you did please like share and subscribe for more content like this. Thanks for tuning in, and we'll see you soon.